Hello and welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do mini tarot messages and it will be for the week of the 6th to the 12th of September 2021. Remember these are mini tarot readings where we look at the potential of the energies that are around you for the next few days and they won't resonate with everybody so just take what resonates with you as always. As you know I am off uh, taking a break uh, but I did kind of say that I would if I could do so many readings so here they are Sagittarius welcome and let's see what we have for you okay what do we have for Sagittarius please for the week message for Sagittarius for the week this is the Druid Tarot deck for those of you who are interested and remember these readings won't resonate with everybody so just take what resonates with you okay Rebirth, Judgment, Ace of Swords, Three of Swords, The Fool, okay Sagittarius. I have a couple of threads that I'm getting here. So, Three of Swords, we know. So, for some of you, there could be, we have two new beginning energies, Ace of Swords and the Fool energy. And Three of Swords, and, and this is dealing with some kind of something that's coming to a close here, and it's dependent on some kind of decision. The Rebirth card, the card of Judgment, can be a card of making judgment calls, making decisions. And generally, the decisions that you make with judgment are karmic. So they will stay with you for quite some time. So it's always a message of choose wisely, decide wisely. Make sure you're making the right decision for you. I feel you are with the Ace of Swords being here, Sagittarius, I have to say. The Ace of Swords is the clarity, the uh, mental clarity on a new path. So this is the way I'm going, this is the direction I'm going in, this is the epiphany, the idea, um, the clarity that you need on a situation and it might well be to make some kind of decision or choice. Now Three of Swords can be a card of emotional pain, heartbreak, I mean there's levels to these cards, can be disappointment, you know, it's, it's a testing energy, something that tests you. Um, can be a difficult truth, third party situation. I mean, you know, all of these cards can can have extreme energies, but some of them can just be to do with the lighter inside of the cards. Three three of swords can be a card of disappointment. Um, either way, Sagittarius, there's some decision that you're making because someone's caused you emotional pain or disappointment, or a decision that you know will will cause emotional pain or disappointment. So again, it'll be different for each of you here. The message is choose wisely with the judgment card. The judgment card can also be a card of forgiveness. So it might well be for some of you, there may well be forgiveness linked with this. It's not always. Uh, it can be an energy of do I stay on this current path or do I go in a different direction? So some significant decision this week for some of you, but I do feel with the Ace of Swords, Spirit is helping bring clarity and illumination and epiphanies, epiphany moments to, to you this week in how this new direction will unfold. You know, the Ace of Swords can be an energy of cutting cords. It can be a card of, of um, sometimes looking at both sides of the situation, but then getting the clarity by looking at both sides you're making the right judgment and decision so it might well be for some of you that that needs to be done here look at every side of the situation and then you will get the clarity that you need and here we have it the big new chapter the big new beginning the fool energy uh, the fool is a card of carving out your own path uh, going in your own direction it can be a liberation energy, it can be stepping on a new path, a new beginning in whichever way resonates for you. But the Fool carries very little baggage. So whatever this judgment has done, 
you are releasing, you are letting go, you are allowing that rebirth to happen. So it means in this situation that you don't carry baggage with you anymore because you have released it. Whatever this new decision or epiphany that is coming to you this week, um, it is allowing you to release, let go and step on a new path that is perfect for you without any baggage. So powerful energy. So you are being presented with some kind of significant decision or choice. But I do feel that there is a significant epiphany moment coming your way, helped by God, the universe, the divine. And it will help to look at both sides of the situation. Okay, final message for Sagittarius, please. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, two cards. Okay. Peacock, self-love, time to celebrate you and your magnificent light. Yeah, maybe there's some self-love that's needed, putting you first. Bear, you are the light. It is safe to step fully into your light. That is the judgment card, stepping into your light. And you do that by releasing what you don't release through decision and choices that you're making this week. So you do that by releasing what you don't need. That's what I want you to say. So you are the light. It is safe to step fully into your light. You're seeing the light. You're seeing the light in a situation and understanding which way you want to go. Powerful new chapter with a fool. I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Thank you.